<laughs> hey, dude, are you okay? I'm not a dude! Regale us. Okay, so basically, I met this guy after the Guns N' Roses concert. Don't touch me. If you touch me, I will kill you, and I'm not gonna have a problem with it. But then he ends up being, like, really nice. I, I go for a woman like you. A woman like me. Meaning what? We spend the whole night together. He's a funeral director. That's so hot. So we hang around, and then we end up going back to his hotel room, where we bang. Shut up and show me your thick rod. <laughs> But he ghosted. Do you want me to drive you to the airport? No, I have my car. I'm sorry, I have a family emergency. You said you flew. Oh, weird. Like, I called him, and I texted him, and I called him again, but it went to voicemail. I didn't leave a voicemail. Talk soon. <laughs> Whoa, okay, I don't know what that was. <laughs> you cared, honey. I cared? Yeah, you freaked him out. You were willing to do too much too fast. This man, this Guns N' Roses man, he is not the end-all be-all. Yeah, you've got to pump the brakes. I mean, this is exciting, but it's sad, too. He ghosted! I really liked him! When people like each other, don't they want to see each other again? Like, why can't I say what I feel? Why can't I say I like you without apparently being some crazy person? Mm -hmm.